fumbled across his gym, his gym, in one of these atheist experience videos. And I'm saying, finally, someone has the fucking clue. Someone is asking the questions I've been asking. But I can't get nobody to listen because nobody's watching my god fucking damn videos on YouTube. But here, listen up. Yeah, I kind of got one that was asked in, in chat that I'm kind of curious about. Um, let's assume for a moment that we have somebody who uh, ends up with Alzheimer's and has no memory of them being a uh, great Christian, however you want to define great, I don't care. Um, they're a great Christian, they get Alzheimer's and they completely forget that they were ever Christian, they don't remember believing in God, and they can't remember anything for, for longer than 10 or 15 seconds. Um, does that person go to heaven because they no longer believe in God? Te I got a better illustration to give you. This Christian worked on the railroad. I've been working on the railroad all the live long day. And he had a metal spike accident driven through his fucking head and he went from being a devoted Christian to a womanizer a drunkard what the fuck happens to this man I thought once you were a Christian nothing nothing for what shall separate us from the love of Christ shall persecution shall distress shall famine shall da 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 how about a freak fucking accident? This man was a loving God Christian till he had his fucking accident in his fucking railroad station. Had a fucking metal spike driven through his fucking head. And now he's a fucking womanizer. Doesn't give a shit about God. What happens to this man? I, I got another scenario. I can't believe the devil's so fucking Dumb. How about a new type of persecution? Instead of just killing Christians or burning them at the stake, how about fucking with their brains, giving them brain surgery to make them forget they were Christians, and then get them to die, to die Jesus because they don't remember being Christians? What happens to those type of people? Man, it's getting dangerous to live. What, happen, what happens to those type, type of people? Look, if God is real, if Jesus is real, there is a fucking answer. Don't you dare accuse me of being snarky. I'm serious as a heart attack. If Jesus is real, there's no question that cannot be answered by God or Jesus. Technically. I mean, gosh, depends on your or your soteriology. This brings up an interesting question, though, because I remember the last time I spent some time with my dad, um, I mean, he, he was gone um, mentally, and I, I, I sat with him. He was in an assisted living home, and I, I, I was at a table. No, someone who's been degenerated due to dementia, God will have mercy on them. They'll go to heaven. I'm not so sure about the guy who had the accident in the railroad station. Or, can you see this in the future? You better deny Jesus right now, or we're going to cut on your brain and make you into such a person that you will forget you, will forget you were a Christian, and then we'll get you to deny Jesus. Table, and I put my, my hand on his arm, and I'm just talking to him, and he, his, when I first came into the room, he was kind of agitated, and he relaxed. He 